Hey everybody, today I am going to be playing Buzzable Garboder. Uh, I've been playing this deck quite a little bit online, I think it's really, really good. Um, I've been telling you guys in the last couple videos that I have a bunch of tournaments coming up, and um, I'm thinking this is going to be the one that I'm going to be playing, just because my friend KP, who's also a part of the channel, is uh, he likes to play Landorus, and he and I, I think are going to be in love with this deck. And it's just so powerful. So there's a little quick overview of the list. I'm not going to go into full detail since this list is being legit everywhere on YouTube. And as you can see, we're 5 and 0 with this list so far. So let's hop into another game. We're going to be really high up on the ladder and uh, see what we can find. Um, Buzzwool, we definitely want to hit something like a Metagross or a Gardevoir. Gardevoir, Gardevoir is still really hard. That's why I still have the Finny in there. And if we face Volcanion. Uh, it's really hard to. It looks like we're facing Metagross, so this should be a very decent matchup for us. And there's my cat. His name is Milo. He has a disability in his nose, so that's why you can hear him. Alright, I'm gonna put him down. Alrighty, so we don't get anything right off the start. Oh, yeah, um,. I'm buying Doom today on the Switch, and I'm happy because that game is awesome. And we start a... Finny. It's better. No, wait, wait. Okay. Because then we can Burjet. Maybe get an end, because I don't want to discard three Ace Rollers. I mean, two. But this card could be end up being useful because Metagross GX stuff. Ah, the kid's making a lot of noise. I'm sorry. What the fuck, kitten? And, uh, is our opponent even here? Hello? Hello, opponent! Oh, okay. And they're playing a Registeel. Interesting. Um, I think this is definitely Metagross. Um, Registeel looks okay. I think it's, like, super good to start with against Gardevoir. That's about it. <laughs> I mean, go ahead and do 30 damage to the tap of Finny. I really don't give a fuck, but... Yeah, and oh my god. This cat just knocked over so many pieces of paper over here. So, this should, this is a really, really good matchup for Buzzwool because Espeon, as long as we don't prize it, is super good. Just being able to do a bunch of damage super early on is just so strong. Um, I have realized that I do know. Oh, Celestelia. Attack does 30 more damage for each color to your opponent's active Pokemon retreat costs. Interesting. Alright, we're gonna go with a full on Bridget, unless it's prize. It's not. And I think we have Lewis and me, so we can discard these. We'll let him attack this. We'll get down two of these boys, and we'll get down the full Art Buzzwell, because that's a cool signal one. Then I'll touch a fighting energy, and we sadly cannot get the turn one attack. So, Celestelia GX being shown here. This is really interesting. We see a Delmise, Delmise here. We see this Registeel. Celestelia, I don't think it's all that great. It's Rocket Fall, it can be interesting, but we only have two retreat costs, so that is legit doing hardly anything. And we're going to see a Guzma on the Buzzwall. I guess, thanks. Uh, Celestelia's. Not gonna be hitting us for much, and then there's Red Steel. Red Steel gonna hit Papa's for 30. I think now we evolve into Garboder, Field Blower, Sycamore. Yikes. Uh, I don't like that. Alright, we'll go ahead and Field Blower that. We'll go ahead and Sycamore. Discarding all these good supporters that I don't want to discard. And we didn't hit the Floatstone, but that's fine. Well, we'll put this down. Put this down, maybe. They wait to sight. No, they're resistant to fighting. Ouch. Shit. That guy's resistant. Alright, so... This looks like it's gonna be a really tough matchup, even though I don't think this is an actual deck that's gonna be played. But we'll go ahead and snipe onto this guy. Uh, Trash Lance and Garbatox are gonna be super useful for us here, guys. So if we can get those guys out, I think we'll be A-OK. -okay. Um, I'm thinking maybe a Ace Arola will be necessary. But we don't have a float stone. 
Let me see a switch, and we're going to see a rocket fall for, looks like 110. And we do get a float stone, but nothing else. Oh, they play Judge. Interesting. I was like, uh, computer, where are my extra two cards? So they're doing 90. Are they going to knock out? Holy crap. That's ridiculous. Well, I'm going to throw up this guy. I think we have to uh, Finny right now. Um, I'm going in Ultra Ball with these two for a Lele, and we're going to go ahead and end. Just give our opponent as little possibility to come back as possible. Uh, I, didn't, I was not expecting to run into this deck. This deck is kind of strange. I didn't know Celestelia was even a card, but here we are playing against it. Got a 5 and a ladder, so let's see if we pull it out. Um, we can special charge, which is nice. We have the rescue stretcher, and we have the ultra ball. Um, I'm an ultra ball with the float stone and the ultra ball. Get me a throw toxin. I will special charge. Shuffling these two back into the deck. And I'll put up a Garboder. I'll retreat and go for a Tapu Storm. Get rid of this Celestia, leaving him with just, just a Reggie. Just a Regi, or just Steel. Man, this deck is certainly interesting. But we do have a bunch of Garboders down, even though there's two items in there. But near the end of the game, it should be a lot of damage. Man, I got all excited. I thought we were playing Metagross. Just like our best matchup. So see our opponent do here. They are going to Field Blower, which kind of sucks. They're going to get some good damage onto this Finny. But I don't think it matters that much. Um, I hope... We kind of need another bench space for our Buzzwall, but that is fine for right now. We really don't have anything else in hand. We don't have any Lele's left, um, so we're kind of in a stuck point right here. We do have a Guzma, so if we do get an energy, we can knock out a Delmise. Just kidding. One, two, three, four. And we see a double colorless energy going onto the Tapu Lele. Is it like any energy with Registeel? It's just a basic. We see a Turbo Arm for 60. I'm not going to do anything. 90. Jesus Christ. Wow. Uh, we get an N, which is great. Yeah, we just end. And we get nothing. We always get nothing. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to Aqua Ring to a frickin' Lele. Just some tip damage and pass. Next turn, we can Acerola if we want to. 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm hitting it for 80, which is enough to knock this out. Yeah, perfect, because it'll do minus 20. But these Delmises are crazy. He also doesn't have any Celestelias, so this is looking really good for us. Even though it looks like we're getting absolutely destroyed, we're not. Um, maybe we Acerola. Yeah, they're going to Acerola themselves, that's fine. Going with a Lele, most likely. You. Look at his tiny ass head. I honestly don't even know what to do. We need a Buzzwool. <sighs> what do we do? Say. Christ. Let's go ahead and Lucamine, maybe, for an N and an Acerola. And then we'll just N, because there's so many supporters. I think we just let him take the knock. Alright, we're gonna Acerola. Touch an energy down here. Touch a Fighting Fury Belt. Next turn we're just gonna straight up Sycamore. We need a Float Stone, or... Yeah, maybe we should've put the Fighting Fury Belt on the Garboder, but I'm not too worried about that right now. There's, I don't think there's any way he can get a, a KO on this Lele right now. See, so you double call this energy coming down to Celestelia. Uh, it is going to do a lot of damage to Garboder. It's definitely going to take a one shot. 
there's four in there right now, and they're just gonna bring up the guard loader, which kind of sucks, but we're going to Sycamore. Doing 150 damage. Oh, we need a Buzzwool right now. Top deck Buzzwool, please. We don't get. Oh my god. This is awful. Like, I was running super hot with this deck when you guys weren't here. And now when you guys are here, I can't get anything going. Right, we'll put down Buzzwool. We'll put down Fighting Fury Belt. We'll put this down. We gotta use some chip damage over there. And we'll retreat over here. And we'll trash Lance. For 80 damage. Say hello back. Look at that. Three Acerolas, two Guzmas, a bunch of energy. We're not looking good right now. <sighs> at least we have the Garbotoxin. Not, I wouldn't say lock, but we have it. He's already played a field blower. I think he'd play more. Um, he's going to Sycamore. And I, he's going to take the knockout here, we're going to end him, and we're going to start using some Buzzwool. Chip damage. Um, I don't think there's a single slight chance of us winning this game, especially since Celestelia is resistant, and it's hitting us for more damage every turn, and we don't have enough Acer Rollers to keep up. Ugh, so frustrating. Hey, we do get a strong energy. We're going in N. We're going to bench this Buzzwall. Put that guy down. We're going to retreat into this guy. And we'll go ahead and get some jet punches onto this. Just going 30 30. That's all we got to do. What? Blaster GX. Does he have another energy to win? Oh my god. Three field blower, are you kidding me? Oh, there. I don't have anything. This can say that's good for us. Um, we are going to Guzma this turn. I'll put this guy down. Um, we'll put. We'll shuffle. And some pieces. Then we're going to Guzma up a random Delmise. Send this guy, Flipstone, Treat. I go ahead and smack for some damage. So we'll see what you can do here. They obviously have a dead hand. They're going to max elixir onto the Celestelia. So now they do have the game if they want to. If they're able to retreat this, which they are. So that's going to be a good game. Uh, we're going to play another game with this, guys, because uh, this is like the worst matchup. And this is definitely not a deck, 100%. It's just kind of random. Okay, so we're going to hop into another game here with Buzzwell Garbodor. We're 5 and 1 with it right now. And we'll see what can happen. Looking for an opponent here. We'll see what our opponent is going to play. Some good matchups include all evolution decks. That's not Greninja. Hey, looks like we're playing the mirror. Interesting. Um Trash Lance Garboters is a king uh, here. So we gotta be really, really careful about our items. And maybe Buzzwool will not be as popular, and this hand's shit. Oh my god. <sighs> if we started anything else other than this Tapu Lele, it would have been fine. Oh, what if we saw with another Tapu Lele? The opponent is definitely playing the same thing. I wonder if they're playing a Drampa. That'd be super good, slash annoying. You know, fighting Fury Belt. Great. Oh, they're playing a Carbank. What the hell are you doing here, Carving? You're only blocking EX Pokemon. Shit. No one plays the X's anymore. We're just gonna see a pet. Hey! Thanks. 
We're gonna get an end here, so we don't have to sycamore all these resources away. We got a buzzwole. A butthole. Oh my god. He just passes. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna go to an ultra ball. Just these two. We're gonna tap Lily for a sycamore. Get some early pressure going. We could go for a Bridget, but I don't think that's the play. I think the play is to Sycamore. Ah, oh, crap, I have four Sycamores, so why am I not using them? Oh well, it doesn't matter. Put in Sycamore. Finding energy, yeah! Alright, awesome. What you want? Turn one to 60 damage. So if he doesn't have anything, then we win. Field blower. Ouch. But we play four of each, so we're fine. See Professor Sycamore. He's dumped two Lele's. If he doesn't find a bench Pokemon, I'm gonna laugh. Damn it. <laughs> There's his own Buzzwool. Um, I think really soon we're going to want to get the Trubbishes going, so I'm going to tap Lele for most likely a Bridget. Um, let's go ahead and tap Lele for Bridget and get down two boys. We got three Lele's on the bench. This is ridiculous. <sighs> Alright, go ahead and Bridget. Put down two Trubbos. And we'll jet punch, taking the KO, and we'll put 30 onto here, maybe. Maybe we can soften up this puzzle. I think it's a better play. Alright, so we take a prize card, and it's an Ultra Ball. That's pretty good. I think I'm going to Guzma up this Buzzwool, the damaged one. So we can start getting more damage onto that. If he starts jet punching too, then that's fine. Uh, we've seen N here. That's fine. We have four supporters in hand. I was about to discard all those. That's one problem I find with another problem I find with this deck: just having so many supporters in hand. It's really annoying sometimes because we have to like. Sometimes we just have to stick more, and sometimes it's really really isn't useful. All right, awesome. Um, we're gonna go right here. We go right here. Go ahead and stick more. And we'll see what we can get. Alright, we're gonna get a parallel city down over here. It's knocking off some Lele's. And we'll jet punch going for the other Buzzwool. Softening up this Buzzwool, so it's gonna be really nice for our Garboder. Look, they already have one in there that's 40 damage. 40 straight up damage. Now that's going to be 120. Since we do have field blur, but he just ended it away, so we'll see. Uh, we're looking really strong right here. I'm pretty happy with our position. Um, we can Acerola, since we do have the float stone, and just pick up this damage buzzball. I guess the play, since we have nothing else. We'll see a Trebo coming down. We gotta be careful about our items, too. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's already 240. Um, I think we ace Rolla. Just because I want to. Maybe. I don't know. Um, yeah, now we have to. Uh, we're going to throw this guy up. Put this guy back down. Put down this. This. Um, put down Floatstone. Tweet and we'll go for a jet punch smack and a trebo. Then we've done enough chip damage to these buzzwolves already, so. Looks like they might go for an absorption GX here. Possibly if they find another energy. Um so we'll see. Yeah, they can do enough for a knockout, that's all I know if they want to, but we're going to be able to rescue Stretcher for a Lele and hopefully find some field blowers so we can take a knockout here. Alright, so now we are going to get an Ultra Ball. Alright, let's go ahead and let's shuffle the Ultra Ball. Go 
put an Ultra Ball, discarding these two for a Lele. We'll get a Lele for Sycamore. Um, they have one, two, three, four. Three to the Field Blower. That's 160. That's enough for Knockout. So we just need to hit a Field Blower and a Trash Lance Garboder. And we'll be sitting pretty with the prize lead. So can we get it? No. We didn't get the field blower. Yikes. Um, we can still attack with Trash Lance Gaboter. That's not a bad idea either. We're so close. We just need a field blower. And right now, their Trash Gun Chaboter is going to wreck our puzzle, so I'm going to try and stay clear of that. We're just smacking them for 80. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh my god. We're not looking good right now, even having a huge advantage early on. I'm just going to knuckle it back. Interesting. Okay. Cool with that. We're going to go ahead and slap a puzzle down, possibly. Yeah, we could lose a mean right now. Um, that's not a bad play. Get some Mace Rollas. And that's what I'm going to do. Grab some Mace Rollas. And just keep chipping away at this Buzzwall, because now he can't attack with it. And we go ahead and slap some more damage onto a Trubbish. So now we can knock this out from anywhere, knock this out from any anywhere. And if he's going to attack us with something that's not a Trash Lance Garboder, then we can do a Cerola. We see a Lele come down here. I see what they get. They're getting an Ace Roll of their own. That's annoying. That's super, super annoying. Oh, these mirror matches, dude. I think we're going to lose this one, too. Like, whenever I'm playing a video, I just lose all concentration, and, and uh, there's too many items in my Discord pile now. And they're going to come with a car bank, and we're going to have to end, which is the play, obviously, because they only have three prize cards. And we'll take a knockout on a Trubbish. It looks like an Ultra Balling for, yep, Trash Lance Garboder. So are they going to attack with him? No. Cool. Do they even play Rainbow Energy? I have to, right? We're going to hit us for 40. We're going to end. We're going to... We can't even knock that out. That sucks so bad. Um, we get a we can save that. We're going to end right now. Try and keep their limited chances of getting that thing that they need. Uh, we're going to put down the trash lanch. That's good. And I think we take the KO here. And we go for some more damage over here. <sighs> okay. Finally get a prize card. And it's an Ultra Ball. So it looks like they did get the Rainbow Energy. Yep. That's gonna be game. 100 percent Boy, you're already doing like 400 damage. <laughs> and I got the Sycamore. Damn. They got the two things we didn't want them to get. How much are they doing? Yeah, 460 damage. Um, we're going to respond with an N of our own. And we get a Field Blower. That's awesome. Um, we'll get rid of these two. Yeah. Um, we'll put this down. Lele for a N. And I'll go ahead and Ultra Ball. Just to send these cards out. I'm not going to need them. Ah, uh, 100% think we lost. I'm going to just go ahead and fail it. Doesn't matter. Yeah, because this come up here and just knuckle impact the game, so. I guess that's it. Okay. Real interesting. If. Because he didn't use jet punch at all. Well, we're going to drop two straight here. Um. Kind of sucks. I was like five and zero with this deck. And I was super hyped to show you guys, and then we're gonna drop two games in a row. 
Yeah. You know that happens. The first game is so fucking weird, and this one we just got kind of destroyed. Um, I think we kind of wrecked ourselves with that parallel city, but I wanted to get some melees off the field so that there's three on there. And uh, missing that field blower on one of the buzzwolves was huge. And I think that would change the course of the game. But anyways, thank you guys for watching so much. Please like and subscribe. And we are going to be filming tomorrow an entire league challenge, maybe three to four rounds. We'll see. And we'll post it on YouTube on Sunday. So we'll see you guys Sunday again. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys later.